Now, is it just me, or does anybody else find it so cool that creation is just at your fingertips? Like, all you even have to do is touch your pencil to paper, and voila, you can make whatever you want. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, it's Sparkle here, and today we are drawing Princess Jasmine from Disney's Aladdin. But do you know what a really cool coincidence was? Yesterday when I was halfway through drawing Princess Jasmine, I got a notification from YouTube and I opened it up and one of my subscribers actually asked if I could draw Princess Jasmine. And it was just so cool at the time because I was drawing her. <laughs> and yeah, we've got Princess Jasmine here today for the seventh day of the Disney drawing challenge that I've been taking on, which in simple, if you're new, just to catch you up, it's pretty much where I'll be drawing 15 Disney characters over 15 videos on my channel. And if you want to find out how the first six went and whether they were a complete fail or a pass, make sure to go and check out those videos and let me know your thoughts. So when I was drawing Princess Jasmine today, I tried doing something that I'm not necessarily the best at, and that is drawing her with crossed arms. Um, it was a little bit challenging, but I really wanted to draw her with crossed arms because I feel like that just adds to her entire confidence, and I also tried to add some confidence to her expression as well. And today we are actually going to be moving quite quickly past the line art stage because there actually isn't too much to see because it's a pretty simple drawing and even the coloring was quite simple because I did use different colors for shading but it was just pretty much her skin tone and a blue for her outfit, brown for her eyes, a goldish kind of color for her accessories and black for her hair which is why I decided to make things a bit more interesting by maybe drawing in the background. So 